Hmm. Not sure how. Not sure how I feel about what happened there. Because <laughs> that should have happened. It should have happened, but it did. Hmm. And to answer anyone's question, yes, I do feel a little robbed by that. Okay, we killed the the uh, rolling lizard, so that might give us a little bit of leeway. You know, I'm just gonna put Monty there. I'm gonna go get that ghost pot. Check to see what's on the other side real quick. One thing of gold, but you know what? We could make use out of it. Please tell me that's not Monty getting... God damn it, Monty. Why you do this, Monty? Why you do this? You... I had you where you could go safe. All you had to do was run over here, and then into this gold pit, Monty. Hey, Maki, how you doing? Welcome to the stream! Hope you're doing well today. Hope you're doing well. Okay. Oh, okay. All right, game. Okay, game. I mean, that was all me right there, but I'm gonna blame the game anyway. <laughs> I wanted to bounce off the spider to see if I could get that uh, three gold that was up top. It's not wor quite worth two gold to. It's not. Sorry, it's not quite worth a rope to get three gold. find the Uja eye. Now here I am saying I need to not go after the secret stuff and just focus on beating the game and yet I'm still trying to do secret stuff which is getting me killed. <laughs> doing just fine? I'm glad to hear you're doing fine. Glad to hear you're doing fine. And I, I, I will have fun on my stream. Even when this game frustrates me, I'm having fun with it. It's because it's just that well made of a game. To where I hate saying it, but anytime something happens, I have no one to blame but myself for it. It's always my fault whenever something goes wrong. <laughs> I mean, there are some points where I feel like things are a little suspect, but. You know? I know that in this game, everything is crafted very meticulously to where, you know, in the roguelike nature, even the procedural generation, is not going to screw you as much. I see a matic. We will bomb for a matic. Okay. Set that there. Frickin' moles, man. I love when they set off the arrow traps for me, but whenever they're just being a mass of pain like this, not so much. Okay. Hey, Ziggy. I need a gun. Those things had to go. Thanks for that, Ziggy. I'm gonna... What's more valuable to us, a gun or a matic? Let's see how many uses we can give the matic here. Okay. So far, we're getting some pretty good use out of this matic. So I won't feel so bad abandoning it for the shotgun. Here in half a moment! Okay, I just realized time it was. The ghost is here. It's time to go. <sighs> okay. You know, I could help Yang. I could. But something tells me I need the HP a little more. Something tells me I need the HP a little more. I'm sorry, Torky. I'm sorry. 
Welcome back, you. Welcome back. How you doing? How is food? Uh, <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna put an asterisk an asterisk on that queue because the answer is. <laughs> food was a bust. Ah, oh, you hate to hear that. Who's the best part of the day? But what happened with the food? You'll just order food later? Ah, fair enough, fair enough. Alright, chicken wings for lunch. Ah. Gotcha. Gotcha. Did I see anything else good out? That's fair. Ah, oh, man, I wish I could... Wait, I do have chicken. I bought chicken the other day. I was about to say, I wish I could have chicken, but, you know, I, I can. I bought some just yesterday, actually. I, I may have broke the law doing it because, well, to be blunt, I'm not supposed to drive due to me having seizures. I drove anyway because it's snowing outside and, like, hell, I'm riding my bike <laughs> during the snow. <laughs> You know, I'm not riding my bike at around 30 miles an hour down the street. <laughs> just, you know, that's iced over just to get a little bit of food and have to, and have to go back and forth twice. <laughs> so, this thing of, yeah, I, I broke the law to do that because, you know, I wasn't supposed to drive. But in the end, it was safer for me to drive in the car than to uh, use than to use my bike, so... Hey, we got... We got the HP and the bomb bag. Nice. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna have the spider come on down. Bonk. Alright, Torky, I'm sorry. But I can't take you through the door, so I gotta put you down. We will remember you. I just wasted a bomb. Alright. I will remember you, Torky, but will you remember me? Our way to a lucky trick or treater. <laughs> oh, it's funny you think it was my car. <laughs> but yes, uh, that, that would be a nice gift to give. Would it feel super cold out there? Yes, yes, it does. It feels extra cold. Extra cold. Don't jump. Okay. Hey, Kikyo, how you doing? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Okay. We're actually making it to the second part of the game now. <laughs> no, I didn't steal a car off the road. I, I asked if I could use someone else's car. Because, you know, mine has no tags or anything on it anymore, so... I mean, when you're not legally able to drive, you don't keep your tags on your car <laughs> up to date anymore. <laughs> Which, in one way, saves an expense. <laughs> I wish it's not here. It's never... Ah! Yeah, I used to I used to want the snow because I lived in a place where snow was very is was very very rare because my old home was Oklahoma and I don't live there anymore. But it's the thing of there was never snow. I used to go, oh man, I want snow. I've never had snow. Plus, I'd want I'd like to get a snow day, you know, off school, you know, back when I was a kid and all that. Then I. Uh, then I moved to where I'm at now, and I thought, oh, cool, snow's really nice. The very next day, I hate snow. Get it out of my life. <laughs> it's too, it's cold, it's grainy, it's, co it's coarse, it cuts me up whenever I'm using it. And most importantly, it's cold. I don't like that. <laughs> I'm a frickin' lizard. Give me the heat. <laughs> Crap. 
I'm sorry, lady. I didn't mean to anger you. Oh, this is... This is bad. This is bad. This is real bad, honestly. That's the mission out of the car. <laughs> yes, Q. I'm a lizard person. More accurately, I'm more of a snake. Oh. There's a leprechaun. Well, what do you know? I feel protected. You know what? There is nothing over here for me. I should just blast these bases, and there we go. We get snow, get the snow, super cold weather. I love taking walks around the snow. Nice. Ah, that is fair. Walking around at night whenever there's snow around. It is rather nice. It is rather nice. I just, again, the cold that comes with it. The cold that comes with it can sod right off. <laughs> okay, so looks like I made a wrong turn to Albuquerque. Or do I have to use a bulb? Oh no, it's over there. Yeah, I made a wrong turn to Albuquerque. And now I can't get back up, so I need to use a bomb. I'm just gonna hit. Oh, but no snow, please touch up to deal with. Ah, it, it is very high maintenance. Hey, Jaime, how you how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Not on a care while you make that wrong turn? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh man, I... I'm gonna miss jumping on carrots. I have to go in for an inspection on my teeth on Monday. It's the first time I've been to the dentist in 13 years, so I'm afraid of what might happen. <laughs> but, you know, it's gotta be done. You gotta visit the dentist every once in a while. Okay, Snake gives back patience, I'd say more of a chameleon. Uh, I, 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 maybe, maybe, maybe. I do just sort of blend in places, so. <laughs> it was playing, when he popped the board game with the bell and switch and smack, so, uh, I didn't know there was a board game of that. Okay, okay. So, which Doctor Man there is going to be a problem? Uh... Okay, which doc? Give me the magic words. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah, ting, tang, walla, walla, bing, bang. Get out of here, lady. No one wants your Girl Scout cookies. Yeah, she's going to chase me down from now on, by the way. Freaking monkey! You tried to steal my cape, you son of a... Into the dentist. Hey, what well, about how many pastas just tell rap? Yeah. Pastas? What are, what are pastas? I mean, I know what pasta itself is, because, God, pasta is tasty. But, uh... I don't think that's the pasta you're talking about. <laughs> I want to your old one because he was always kind of pull happy. Ah, ah. So his main thing was that he wanted to just pull everything out instead of actually working on it. Gotcha. Yeah, I've seen dentists like that. That's what one of my wisdom. That's what one of the dentists that did my wisdom teeth was like. They were thinking, oh, we'll just pull the teeth around it, too, to make this easier. I went, no, you will not. <laughs> Thinking of, my other teeth are fine. I want to keep those. <laughs> you know? <laughs> well, thankfully, I'm not playing start now. Ah, good call, good call. You want to try to keep as many teeth as you can, after all. They're they're literally linked to your heart health, so... Hmm. Oh, different over there? Ah, tooth fillings! Okay, yeah, I know what those are. 
I didn't know they were called pastas. Oh, let me guess, for impostas? Is it a pun? Please tell me it's a pun. Okay, there's our exit. Is there a safer way down? No. All right. We have circumnavigated the maze. And we are now leaving this floor. We work on stuff, but sometimes stuff feels especially big. He's just pulling them. Oh, wow. Wow. That's... Wow. Dental pasta's here? Gotcha. I sick Yonkum up. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds about right. Because there's a lot of dentists who want to do that instead because they just don't want to spend their time on things. And pretty much they can still charge you about the same amount of money. They really can. Because the checkup I'm going to go into uh, here soon... It's, uh, it's just a checkup, but I'm... Oh, Lord. Poison snake. Okay, it's just a checkup, but they are charging around $1,000. Just for a checkup. Just for a checkup, $1,000. Oh my lord, what is this? What is this fresh hell? Um, why are there so many voodoo doctors? That's... That, that did not ha have me having any feel-goods. That was a, way too many voodoo doctors for my liking. Okay, Black Market is here. Let me find the entrance. I don't have any more bombs! That was my last bomb! Unless that crate up there has some. Can I even get to that crate? I can. That takes some work, but I can do it. Can't get to the crate. There's a. Oh, are you freaking kidding? This game has screwed me. By that one witch doctor being, by those few witch doctors being there, making me need to use my bombs. It has screwed me. I can't go to the black market now. I have to just exit and beat the game without anything from the black market, which is going to be really rough. Black market was the entire reason I came this direction. Dentistry, but I think to hunt for shiny trap hats right after we turn from braiding the fridge. All right, well, we'll see you in a second, Kirby. See you in a second. All right, we are now at Olmet. So, you know what I say? You can smoke them if you got them, smoke them. Let's do this. Come on, Olby. Anything up top? Yes! Olmec's gonna try to crush us. That's nothing new. We're used to this. He did it in Spelunky 1. He did it in Spelunky Remastered. He, he's doing it here. Since we saved all three children of the forest, we did get the bomb box, which is nice to have. So, Olmec, do you want to come over this way? Just a little bit. Just a little bit, Olmec. Come on. This way. Over here. Come on. Over here. Over here. See? Yeah. Alright. I can do this. Just gotta. As soon as he pauses, I I have half a second to move over. <laughs> All right, and now it's time for the coffee break because we gotta let Olmec do his thing here. Because Olmec 2.0, he likes to throw down bombs, and even though we don't have the hedget or anything from the black market, we're still gonna try to get the onk because the onk is a free revive, which I don't think I need to mention how how handy that comes in. And he switched to mobile twitch so he can keep chatting? Oh, nice! Well, glad to have you here still, Kirby. Glad to have you here still. <sighs> so what's everyone up to, you know? Just, uh... Relaxing. 
having fun, chilling. We're gonna model for VRC. Nice, nice. Man, I have not played VR chat in a while. I got sort of scared of it because, well, I saw that if you if you go into there, people have worlds set up that are made specifically to steal your models that you're using, your avatars. So since I don't want anyone stealing my personal avatar that I have, I sort of I may or may not have stopped using it just to be on the safe side, you know. We'll let Olmec do his thing, maybe... You know what? Once we get over to the right side, we're gonna jump down and shoot Olmec in the... in the orbs below. In his lower... Well, he's a Bolchinian. Uh... <laughs> Mobile switch the site behind the browser version? Eh, that, ha that happens. To be expected with mobile. Happened once, like a long, t a long time ago. Oh, sorry to hear it happened to you once. Okay, I think he's gone. I think he fell all the way down. Where are you, Olmec? Oh, he fell really far down. Where'd he go? Wait, did he go into the lava already? Nope, he's still here. Okay. This presents a problem. Good thing we have climbing gloves. All right. There we go. We got it. You know, we've been to the tide pool a lot, so I actually want to go to the temple this time. Because then you have upgrade your faces and textures so they look way better than the old carpets. Ah, nice. Okay. Oh, right. We still have to worry about uh, Hood Lady wanting to uh, cap us with an arrow. Alright, so we gotta be careful because as soon as we go into the next zones, things are gonna be much, much harder. Why? Why would I... I saw the spider was there. Why did I run into it? Why would I do that? Okay. There's the Ankh. Got our parachute. We don't have much in the way of traversal items. You could really, really use some spring shoes or spike shoes right now. But you know what? We take what we can get. I said we're going to the temple this time, so we're going to the temple this time. After I grab this treasure. Alright. Not today. Okay, it already happened today, but not again today. <laughs> there we go. That's more of a statement. Alright, so now that that's done, we're just gonna... That's a lot of lava. Uh, we're just gonna go ahead... Take this door, get on out here, and let's see if we can get ourselves a, a W. You want my gun? This is a mistake, but sure. Oh, that was a big mistake. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we're not going that way. I don't have paste at all. I should have kept my gun. Don't mind me, Anubis. I'm your friend. We're buddies. We're pals. Don't touch this. Don't touch the cats. The cats emit curse, and curse puts you down to one HP permanently. You. Oh. 
Got him. All right, sorry, Anubis, I had to do that. I need a weapon, and you had the Scepter of Domination. Doesn't hurt this friends. Yeah. Yeah, true, true. Oh! That scared the crap out of me. That straight up scared the crap out of me. Gonna be honest. When I saw that giant thwop come, come up, that scared the crap out of me right there. <sighs> Somehow, we live. And we're now at 8 HP instead of whatever we were at. All in all, net win. We're net gain, technically, but... So we need to drop down and enter the door. Okay. Okay, we made it. Back on Brass Stretch and Tire Container Applesauce because costume. Because which was there? <laughs> What's Echoes in here? Wow, that is a lot of pots. Such a fits, but nothing is happening. That's because we don't have the hedge it. Okay. Gotta be careful. Gotta be careful on our way out. I say as I almost give myself with that. Okay, which way to get to our exit? Okay. Alright. I see how it's gonna be. We gotta go back up. Gotcha. I, I like the scepter, but it scares the daylights out of me with... <laughs> I can't get down that. I have to, I have to find the other way. All right. Oh, this gonna suck. This gonna suck. This gonna suck. Okay. Sinking sand. Okay. So I'm not the only one who saw the giant- who sees the giant womp over there, right? I mean, technically, I could have avoided it, but it's better just to do this and be safe than sorry. Okay. That's subspace, that's not the exit. Crap! was the exit. I thought it was the exit. Okay, we just... We gotta get out of here. We just gotta get out of here. Don't worry about money. Ooh, crate. Ooh, no, no, you stay back. No, no. Where is our exit? This floor is so... so long. I just want to escape. I gotta use a rope. Alright. Is that purple orb right there? That can kill us. That's why I'm having to be very cautious with this. What fresh hell is this? Okay, there's the door. There's the door. We're out. Oh. Wait for the snake to turn around. Just wait for the snake. Because if we get poisoned, that's also the end. <sighs> okay. We're going to try taking our leave to the left here, because I think that might... Excuse me? You were dead, were you not? Oh, there's a necromancer somewhere. Okay. No, 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 wake up, wake up, wake up. Oh, for crying out loud. Nothing. 
Oh, we shouldn't have given up our shotgun. Shouldn't have given up our shotgun. That one... That one hurts. Giving up our shotgun is what screwed us there. 